Erik Kemsen går på stranden på Lesbos. Der ligger gummibåde og redningsveste for de bådflygtninge, der er flygtet gennem Tyrkiet. Hver morgen kommer han her for at hjælpe flygtningene. The men, the men sit around the outside, all the way around, and the women and children are in the middle. And you get 50-60 people. We had one boat with 76 people on. Selvom de har redningsvest på, er det ikke ufarligt. This is what gets to me. This is for a baby. Hang on. I can see it right on the side now. It's definitely going to the left. Denne morgen kommer der fem både. Yeah, I can see one, two, three. Yeah, four, five at the moment. Den græske kystvagt redder dem op for bådene. De flygtninge, der kommer i land på stranden her, skulle indtil for to uger siden gå alle 60 km til den store by Mytilini for at blive registreret. For hverken turister eller grækere måtte give flygtningene et lift, ligesom de heller ikke måtte give dem vand eller mad. Den lov er blevet lavet om, så nu sørger læger uden grænser for, at flygtningene bliver kørt i busser hen til flygtningelejrene. Julia Kurafa viser rundt i flygtningelejren Karatepe. The garbage is everywhere. Nobody cleans the place. And also there are very very few taps for water. Like only five taps in all this camp. Og det er ikke mange vandhaner til de omkring 3000 mennesker der bor i lejren. And uh, there are only 18 to 20 toilets. Og manglen på toiletter mærker John Horror og hans familie. A so simple thing in Uh, life, toilets. There is women. They can't go anywhere. They are going in this, uh, this wares. It's so hard to us. Også mad er der mangel på. They are given food three times a, a day, but the food is not enough because uh, uh, for breakfast they give one piece of bread for the whole family. De fleste der kommer til Lesbos er flygtet fra Syrien. Airplane was. Uh, Killing the people. I had seen people dying our house. A farm. Every day, almost thousand people are arriving at the island, and the, the Greek authorities and the Greek states cannot cope with this. It's a European problem, and, and the, the people from the European Union and the member states should understand. Og for John og hans familie er der bare et ønske at komme til Europa. Because uh, they are living in peace.